Deep within the heartland of China, nestled between windy hills and sprawling landscapes, lies a place frozen in time. An alarming and astounding sight is waiting for you in this abandoned field. More than 10,000 electric cars, once symbols of hope, now sit abandoned. They decay, ignored, while the sky watches. Each lifeless vehicle shares a story of lies and broken assurance. Today, we embark on an amazing adventure, exploring the mysteries within these silent cars and unraveling their secrets bit by bit. Let's dive in. But before we get started, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. In the city of Shenzhen, a place known for its technology and ambition, there's a secret hiding behind the shiny skyscrapers. It's a strange sight that's hard to understand. A field filled with abandoned electric cars left to decay. This raises questions about China's effort to go green and the real cost of progress. Why would China, a leader in electric car sales, leave a whole fleet to waste away? What's the truth behind the numbers and headlines that boast about their environmental achievements? And what does this mean for our environment and the future we want? Imagine a huge field stretching far and wide. Once vibrant and green is now covered in rusty, silent cars. These are not just any cars, but new models from 2021. They look untouched with only a few miles on the clock. The license plates remind us of a broken promise. How did these cars end up here abandoned and forgotten? How did they go from being ready to change the streets to being left behind? Well, there are a lot of questions to be answered. Behind this sad sight lies a disturbing truth. Some electric vehicle makers in China, like BYD, cheat the system to get government subsidies and stay ahead in the market. They pretend to sell these cars even though they don't have real buyers. It's all about making their numbers look good so they can claim success and get more money. But this race for numbers has casualties. It's not just these abandoned cars, it's also the truth that gets hidden behind fake numbers. China has a history of investment schemes that start strong but fail because of deception. Do you remember the trend for sharing bicycles? Bikes of all different colors were everywhere, promising a more environmentally friendly method of travel. However, it was shown to be a scam that was the result of greed and poor investments. Amounts of abandoned bicycles were left to rot when they failed, revealing the waste of such opportunistic strategies. However, investors failed in implementing their lesson. The new fashion was electric cars, so they moved on. In the 2018 documentary, No Place to Place, one filmmaker revealed the fallout from the failed bicycle sharing program. It served as a warning about the effects of uncontrolled investing. But that's not where the story ends. In 2019, the same filmmaker returned to capture another chapter in China's pursuit of profit at any cost. This time, the focus was on the abandoned fields of shared electric vehicles, showing how the industry had gone wrong. Shared electric vehicles seemed like a great idea, a convenient and eco-friendly solution for city transportation. But in the rush to make money, too many cars were produced without proper planning or thinking about the consequences. And the consequences go beyond just the abandoned cars themselves. They extend to the environment we want to protect. Each discarded car isn't just a waste of resources. It's also a ticking time bomb filled with harmful chemicals. These chemicals can be released into the air, soil, and water, causing more harm. Electric vehicles, which are often seen as a solution to our environmental problems, actually come with their hidden costs. Making EV batteries requires mining minerals like lithium, cobalt, and nickel, which have serious environmental and human rights issues. Irresponsible mining practices, along with weak regulations, have led to deforestation, water pollution, and the displacement of local communities. When China abandons these electric vehicles, they waste precious resources and contribute to environmental harm. This reality is a stark contrast to the eco-friendly image the electric vehicle industry tries to portray. Although these cars save carbon emissions during use, the negative impact of their production and abandonment far outweighs the benefits. We shouldn't sacrifice our planet for progress. Behind China's electric vehicle graveyard, a deeper issue emerges, a secretive system with no one taking responsibility. 
It's important to understand that the saved emissions from these vehicles gets overshadowed by the harmful effects of their production and abandonment. This perpetuates a cycle of environmental damage. China's main focus is on growing its economy and attracting investments. This means they often don't pay enough attention to the environment. These places have lots of old electric cars that are just sitting there causing harm to the environment. It's a big problem that shows we need to be careful about green technology. So guys, that was it for this video. What did you think about our video? Let us know in the comment section below. If you are new to our channel, be sure to subscribe and ring that notification bell to get notified about our latest videos. Thanks for watching.